Questions for Jimmy? What's up, Jimmy? How is it having uh, T.O. out here? Is, he, is that a receiver that you looked up to? Yo, most definitely. Uh, having T.O. out here, he, he actually get to sit and observe and watch us play, and then he get to criticize our game, but in a good way, and help us out in a good way. Right now, I came up to uh, do this interview, but tomorrow I'm going to catch him for the rest of the week he here and get some work in with the practice and stuff like that. You were dealing with a little bit of an injury at the end of spring. When were you kind of back to, to full go? Uh, probably like two two weeks after I, after we got back from the break. Uh, it still it still bothered me a little bit, but it ain't nothing to it because I've been getting my treatment and stuff on it, so I'm gonna come back better. I'll be good by TCU week. Like I'm I'm about ninety five right now, trying to get to a hundred. But you'll never play a, a college game hundred percent. As you like the first first two games, first three games, you'll probably be about a hundred percent, but. After that, I'll be playing like this for real. What's it like having your good friend Xavier Weaver here? Do you guys keep it competitive with each other? And overall, what's that relationship like? Uh, you know, man, Zay, we locked in. So, like, having Zay here with me, it, it feels good because, you know, like, we both competitive individuals. Like, we, we push each other every day in practice and we push other receivers. And that's just, like, the whole room. Like, I know what they expect out of Zay. So, like, when he do things in practice, it don't surprise me because I done seen it before and I know how he's stepping. And, uh, but, yeah, that's really about it, though. But Zay, that's my dog that we locked in for life. Mm -hmm. Speaking of the two of you, how often do you guys talk about or think about like the opportunity that you now have together coming from a bit of a tough situation last year at South Florida now getting to play with Shador? Uh, I mean, like, man, Zay, we, we kind of had this talk a lot because it's like, it's like we, we know what like, we're here for. And like, we both, like when I first met Zay, it was my freshman year. Like, I just, we just clicked then. And so like, every time, it's like every time I play with them, it's like we, we compliment each other in the game in a certain way. It's just, it's just hard to stop us two when we on the field together. And like having Shador as our quarterback, like we both will be able to get the opportunity to shine even harder. When you add Travis and Javon and Willie and all these guys to you and Xavier, how much fun is this receiver group and what's the competition like day to day? Uh, really like having, we got, I mean, we, we got a ton of to receiver room. Like, we got whatever you're looking for, bit body. We got SRTs. We got Hellcats. We got all that. Like whatever you're looking for, we got it for you. So like having like really our whole receiver room, everybody got their own game, and like we all complement each other in a good way. So it's hard to stop us. What about going up against the corners? Has anybody caught your eye? Uh, outside of probably Travis. I don't usually go against the corners. I've been the slot, so I go against safety. I like Miles Flesh, Shallow. Uh, Quez, little little breed, little. I ain't gonna lie, we, we got they got some talent back there, so they got they got some good duck back there. It's like it's one in and one out, so you never know what you're getting. But I know like our safety and stuff, they they coming with it. What do you see from the younger guys in your room? Seems like Omari and Miller has kind of got a flash yeah. so far. Omar and, and uh and Hawkins, them both of them boys, they doing their thing right now. They uh you can tell they want it. Like most friends come in with like that mindset, like. They don't want to play, and I see it in them too. Like they, they got, they know they got a chance of playing, so they doing everything they can do to get out there on that field. Are there any ways that it's different playing receiver for Shador than other quarterbacks you play with in your career? Nah, not really. A ball is a ball. Like when you throw the ball, it's just like it's a ball. So I just try to make a play. It's our, it's our goal to make the, it like it's our job to make the quarterbacks right. It don't matter who, which quarterback you play for. But playing with Shador, like he got a good ball placement. Though, I can tell you that, real smart, and uh. It's really like, that's how it is, though. What kinds of things do you learn from Coach Brett? Coach Brett, uh, he just teach you like the little small things in the game. And uh, we like do like the individual drills, teach us how to read coverage and stuff like that. How about the scrimmage the other day? It sounds like maybe the defense won a little bit. Yeah, Coach defense, Barlow on the same, defense shot yourself got on in the us. foot a little bit. Yeah, defense, defense got on us, but really a lot of that came from mental mistakes on offense side. Like we watch the film and stuff like that. We see, we see what we messed up at. Like, it plays that, that could have been made, but it's, like, mental mistakes, like, jumping offside that pushes us back. All start that pushes us back. Like, it's just, like, little things like that that, that killed us and we shoot ourselves on our foot. Are you seeing mistakes that you make at practice that get recognized in the film room? Are you able to correct those on the field the next day? Maybe yeah, as a most team? definitely. That hawk don't miss nothing. That hawk in the sky don't miss nothing. So, every time you see yourself on film, like, I just know I messed up on out there on the practice field. I'd be like, damn, I got to watch. This. My bad. Be like, I gotta watch this on the on film, and you know that's how. Yeah.
How do you feel like your game has developed from spring to now? Uh, I feel like from like really from the spring, more I got more. I'm more comfortable out here. Like I can express myself on the field better. I feel like I like in spring like more tensed up. Like I just had to prove a point. But really, all I gotta do is just be myself on the field and play how I play, instead of just trying to do do more than what I need to do. Just do what I do. Good for Jimmy. Thanks, Jimmy. Thanks, Jimmy. Thanks, Jimmy. Thanks, Jimmy. Thanks, Jimmy.